President Paula May Weeks joins with the international community in advocating for the perpetrators of crimes against journalists to be brought to justice. Today, Saturday, November 2nd, is the International Day to End Impunity for Crimes Against Journalists. It's a UN-recognized International Day observed annually to draw attention to the low conviction rate for violent crimes against journalists and media workers. A statement from the President notes that although Trinidad and Tobago ranks 39 out of 180 countries on the World Press Freedom Index, there have been a number of incidents over the years in which journalists have been threatened or even assaulted. She says during the 1990 attempted coup, several journalists were intimidated, humiliated, beaten and held captive over the course of several days. Impunity, President Week notes, has far-reaching consequences. It emboldens perpetrators and discourages journalists from reporting.